Just like in all walks of life, there are certain ways that you should act and talk to not get lynched or, you know, chased off. Okay, noted. <laughs> really? Huh. I need to reassess my life. There are a few things you should never say at the dive site, otherwise you will never get invited back. Dive sites are obviously more relaxed than dinner with your in-laws, so you'll probably hear some, you know, vulgar language and we'll take the mick out of each other, but there is a line that you should never cross. So yeah, hi, I'm Mark from Simply Scuba and this is five things to never say at the dive site. All this, yeah, it's all brand new. It's fine to buy lots of gear all at once, and a safe dive site is probably one of the best places to get used to it, but you will see a lot of old, let's say seasoned equipment at the dive site, and there's no need to make the other boys and girls jealous. We all can't afford the latest scuba kit, because I just bought a Volvo. <laughs> <laughs> New kit often needs to be worn in before it works perfectly, so maybe not announce to the whole dive site that all of your gear is brand new. And you know, there may be some sticky fingers around there if you know what I mean. All this, yeah, I made it myself. Uh, yeah, no, customizing and making your own kit isn't the best idea unless your name is, you know, John Scuba Pro or Ellen Mares. So keep it to yourself or just leave your handmade kit at home. They did it back in the 60s, they could do it now. Yeah, when they weren't recording like mortality rates and stuff. <laughs> oh, what's your cylinder made out of? Oh, fire extinguishers. <laughs> right guys, I'll see you in an hour. I'm diving alone. Yeah, yeah no. Uh, most dive sites won't even allow you to dive by yourself and it's important that you don't. It's not because we get lonely waiting for you as surface support, although it does get pretty boring as surface support at times, but if you do get stuck somewhere and something goes wrong, I'd rather have a buddy or two or even three to get me out of that trouble. Oh, can you carry my stuff? Yeah, cheers. Dive masters are great when you're an instructor. They carry your kit around for you and they do a lot of the legwork, but we don't all have a faithful DM. So yeah, you know, you know what? You can just carry your own stuff, okay? It may not feel heavy in the water, but out of the water, yeah, carrying your kit sucks. And yeah, it sucks for all of us, so you can just do it yourself. Uh, yeah, Nitrox 32, please. Uh, I'll pay you back. Promises, promises. <laughs> I can barely remember your name, to be honest. So how am I gonna hunt you down and get my money back? I barely trust my own best friend to pay me back for Nitrox. So yeah, no, money up front, please. So what else should you never say at the dive site? Other than, you know, the pure hatred that just comes out of Robin's mouth when the cameras stop. Uh, thanks for watching and safe diving. We are an online dive store serving the UK and the world for all your diving equipment needs. So why not visit us at simplyscuba.com or click the box on your screen.